Mother Nature is throwing some wicked curveballs into travel plans. On the roads where there are flash floods and snow out west, a sprawling storm system bringing disruption and sometimes a savage beauty. Take a look. Storm chasers at our affiliate KOCO captured this picture, a rainbow arcing over a torrential column of rain in Oklahoma. And ABC Steve Osinsami now starts us off as this family weekend begins. Families in Pensacola who were just starting to dry out from last week's floods and were getting ready for Mother's Day today are back getting more sandbags. The last thing they need is coming, more rain and a flash flood watch tonight. It's been a difficult situation to go through flooding and then know that we're possibly going to go through it all again. Across Missouri and southern Illinois, they weren't running over to mom's house. They were running for cover. The blinding rain, high winds, and a reported tornado pulling trees out of the ground. Tonight, there are travel issues in Dallas. 60 flights canceled and over 300 delayed. The same storm turned creeks into rivers and reduced visibility across the city Thursday. This was the view from offices downtown. Yeah, it's a hurricane out here. They could hear the tornado sirens blaring. <laughs> South of Fort Worth, Kelsey Fryer and her newborn daughter made it out of their mobile home alive after high winds tore it to pieces. The poor baby was left with a scratch on her nose. It really scared me. She's only a month and a half. The severe weather continues east through the weekend, but most of what you'll need to look out for is a new system that hits a wide midsection of the country on Mother's Day. Damaging winds and isolated tornadoes are possible, but the bigger story Sunday will be across much of Colorado. A major snowstorm could bring up to a foot of snow in places, slowing travel down.